Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Vilma. Today I'm doing a very much impromptu type of video. I really wanted to share with you guys my top five influencers or content creators here on YouTube. These are people that I have been possibly following for quite some time. I really, really enjoy their content and I want to share my thoughts with you guys and why I'm following them. A lot of them really give me inspiration and they give me guidance on how to look, how to apply my makeup and how to look put together. As a content creator myself, I still follow other fellow YouTubers. So for those of you who look up to me for possible sizing and styling of items, I want you to know that I do the same thing as you behind the camera. I also look at other people for inspiration. So I do hope that you guys enjoy this video and let's get started. The first one that I want to talk about is Lydia Tomlinson. I believe that's how her name is pronounced and I'm really sorry if I am butchering her name, but I absolutely adore her. Love her style. She's very chic and she really knows what she's talking about. Every time I look at her videos or a post that she has on Instagram, I find so much inspiration from her daily outfits to the way she applies her makeup. Everything is is very very in tune with my own aesthetic and I really really love watching her videos. I remember following her first on Instagram and then when she started doing videos on YouTube which I hope that her channel grows a lot more I just fell in love with her and I really really like her style. I love the fact that she is very much she's a very very classy young lady but her style is very approachable it's nothing that you're you would not be able to wear I think any type of woman would be able to wear the outfits that she creates from a young lady because she's young I believe she's in her 20s and I'm in my 40s and I still relate to her content and she really gives a lot of tips and advice on how to style for example she has a really nice video which I'll link below on how to style neutrals and I absolutely love her you guys need to check out her channel for sure next I want to talk about Jamari she is located in Miami and she has has this gorgeous gorgeous accent sometimes I get so distracted when she's talking because I just love her accent one of the things that I love about her as well is the way she styles her outfits she's very dainty chic and casual at the same time she got me into the kitten heel and the mules I really love the way she puts her outfits together she does a lot of like neutral outfit videos she in embraces her curves and she always says that she likes her clothes like for example her jeans to be really tight to really hold her in and she has an amazing body by the way I think she's like five foot eight I think her outfits are very very put together she also talks about materials and how she wants the outfits to sit on her body her body shape is definitely different from mine and from Lydia but she embraces the curves which I think it's fantastic she'll wear something very very chic and wear trainers and it looks amazing and I really really love watching her videos she also gives a lot of recommendations on how to not spend too much to be a little bit more conscious to be a little bit more in tune with the pieces that you already have you may not need more so she is very very approachable I find like she's like the girl next door and I really really love her channel so again check the info bar Below. Next, I want to talk about Jess. She has a channel called Fashion Plus Style Edit, and I absolutely love her. Like, I really, really love the way she carries herself in her video. She seems to be really, really sweet, and she definitely knows what she's talking about. I would say Jess and I are probably in the same kind of like age group. Not entirely sure, but I believe we are. And I really, really relate to her style. She has a very, very sophisticated and casual style at the same time. She can wear a pair of jeans with trainers and a t-shirt and she still looks very very chic I just think it's the way she carries herself the way she does her hair everything about her for me It's almost like perfection. I love her style because she's very on trend, but she chooses classic pieces She's very big on materials and fabrics So anything that has polyester she won't buy and if she does it probably has a very 
very, very small percentage in there. The way she speaks in her videos is very professional. She's very soft spoken. I absorb everything that she actually says. She did a video very recently, which got me smiling from start to finish, where she spoke about a pair of shoes that she wore on her first date with her husband 18 years ago. And the shoes are beautiful. She spoke about investment pieces. She likes things very simple, but she also has a little bit of an edginess to her. And I really, really like her channel. Next, I want to talk about Coco Beauty. Oh my God, I absolutely love this girl. I love her fashion sense so much. Love the way she edits her videos. It feels like you're watching something that was produced professionally, like on TV. The information that you need to gather and the feeling from her outfits to her jewelry, you really get it in the editing part. She's very soft-spoken, very smart with her shopping style, which at times can be casual, but she still looks very, very chic. I love how much information she actually provides, whether she's doing a voiceover or actually sitting down and telling you about the pieces that she's buying. She's one of the content creators that I relate the most when it comes to dress style because she wears a lot of blazers, a lot of trousers. She does wear dresses, but I don't know. There's something about her style that really, really resonates with me. And I absolutely love her. And the last content creator that I want to speak about is Stephanie Marie. She is one of my favorite, favorite persons to watch every time I am looking to buy a new foundation, a new powder, any type of makeup. I will check if she's done a review. She is in my age group. She has combination to oily skin like me. So I actually relate to a lot of the issues she's had previously to knowing everything when it comes to makeup. I learned a lot from her. She definitely knows what she's talking about and she gives fantastic tips, demonstrations of how to use makeup and I love her. Very recently I was struggling with my makeup because I was setting my foundation with a finishing powder and I've been doing that for years and after watching her video I was like oh my god I always thought that finishing powder and setting powders were the same thing but they are not. So I learned it, I bought a new powder which I now set my foundation with with because of her. There's so many other things that she's shown me on how to look so much better with my overall makeup. As you guys already know, I don't like a lot of makeup, although I have made an effort to look good my makeup doesn't look all made up i look natural and that's just my go-to that's just what i like even if i wear eyeshadow like i'm wearing today i always tend to buy stuff that is a little bit more natural that suits my skin tone and she really has helped me achieve different looks wearing less or more but still achieving that flawless, sometimes glowy, most of the time matte because I have combination to oily skin, but she definitely has helped me. Her tips are amazing. And if you have combination to oily skin and you're going through some issues with your makeup, please check her channel out. She is absolutely amazing. So we've reached at the end of this video. I do hope that you guys enjoyed this impromptu video, which is very, very different from my channel. If you did enjoy it, please make sure to give this video a good thumbs up. It would mean the world to me. If you would also consider subscribing to my channel, I do one to two videos a week related to fashion, lifestyle, and beauty here and there. And if you like the sound of that, hit that bell notification so you don't miss any future uploads from myself. Thank you so much for joining me and I'll see you on my next one. Bye.